given the sides of a triangle a b and c prove that the median ma drawn to the side a can be computed by the formula ma equals to half of square root of 2b square plus 2c square minus a square or half into under root 2b square plus 2c square minus a square so we have been given a triangle abc now bc is lower case a small a and ab is small c and ac is small b we need to find out the length of median drawn from vertex a onto bc or onto the side with side a lower a bc is a ab is c ac is b now what we have done the first thing is we have drawn ad d is dividing bc into two equal parts ad is median and we want to use pythagoras theorem to solve this problem so we have dropped a perpendicular or we have drawn an altitude from a on to bc now the approach to solve this problem is we want to use leverage pythagoras theorem so we want to see how many triangles we have where we can apply pythagoras theorem and try to manipulate them so that we can find out the ma so how many right triangles we see here we see three right triangles so let's write down pythagoras theorem for each one of them first is triangle abx in which we can write down c square equals to h square plus x square that's our equation number 1 then that is triangle abx then we have triangle acx where we can write down b square equals to h square plus a minus x whole square that's number 2 then the third triangle we have is axd there applying pythagoras theorem we can write down m a square equals to h square plus xd what is length of xd a by 2 minus x because bd length is a by 2 and b bx is lower case x so xd is a by 2 minus x now these three tri these three equations we will leverage to solve this problem so let us see now what we need to find out we will write down m a square equals to h square plus open the brackets we will have x square plus a square by 4 minus ax now this is what we need to find out and we have to prove that that is equals to whatever they have given so we have to remove h and x from we have to remove h x from whatever the m a square value we want to find out because final answer should be in terms of the sides a b c only so for that we will leverage whatever we have here we will leverage the equations we have so let's have a look at that equations and see i'll write down here the equations what they say one we know that c square equals to h square plus x square that means i can write down that as c square now next i need to find out what is ax to find out ax what i will do i'll subtract 1 from 2 and i will write down c square equals to h square plus x square and we have b square equals to h square plus a minus x whole square 
now let us try to subtract this and see what we will have b square minus c square equals to h square h square will cancel we will have a minus x whole square minus x square so b square minus c square equals to a square plus x square minus 2ax minus x square x square x square will cancel so then we can write down that minus 2ax equals to b square minus c square minus a square or we can write down minus ax equals to b square by 2 minus c square by 2 minus a square by 2. Now minus ax will substitute from here whatever we got then we can get the final step. So let us write down the final step. So write down m a square equals to h square plus x square we will take it as c square then plus a square by 4 minus a x can be written as plus b square by 2 minus c square by 2 minus a square by 2 and when we simplify that we will have m a square equals to c square minus c square by 2 that is c square by 2 a square by 4 minus a square by 2 that is minus a square by 4 plus b square by 2. In the next step we can write down m a square equals to 1 by 4 into 2c square minus a square plus 2b square. When we take square root on both the sides, we will have m a equals to 1 by 2 into square root of 2b square plus 2c square minus a square. Let us have a recap of this problem what we have done. We have been given that there is a triangle with sides a, b, c and we have to we have been asked to find out the length of the median drawn from vertex a onto the side bc so we have leveraged pythagoras theorem to do that we have dropped a altitude from a to x ad is the length what we need to calculate that is m of a so we have three right triangles we have applied pythagoras theorem on these three triangles one is axb axc and axd we have written the Pythagoras theorem. What we need to find out is m a square equals to h square plus a by 2 minus x whole square. We expanded it and we understood h square plus x square can be substituted by c square. And to calculate the value of a x, we su subtracted 2 minus 1, 2 from 1, and we got that minus a x equals to b square by 2 minus c square by 2 minus a square by 2. Then we simplified that we took square root on both the sides. We got m a equals to half into square root of 2b square plus 2c square minus a square. 